Uh, highly honored president of the forum, Mr. Organovich, Or Or excellencies, friends, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, there was a speech in Latvian and in English, and now I'll speak in Russian. It takes place in very troublesome time for the European Union. We see wars, we see bloodshed around Europe on European borders, in the Ukraine, in North Africa, etc. We see one of the deepest crises in the relationships between EU and Russia, which led to sanctions. We see threats to what is the symbol of the European Union, the continent where no visas are used, the continent without borders as they used to say. We watch this crisis every day on the TV, in the internet. We hear rumors about uh, visas being introduced, etc. This is the deepest crisis probably since the year 1989 and the times of Cold Wars. In order to overcome this challenge m quicker and more effectively, you remember that uh, for this we always need a vision, a dream, a dream which appeared in the times of Cold War about United Europe. For this vision to emerge, we need experts on the one hand, politicians who take who are decision makers, on the other hand, and places like the Baltic Forum can help Europe overcome the crisis. This is why the Baltic Forum, in particular given the specific situation of Latvia, it's the place where it's convenient to come together for people from all over Europe, from the USA, our friends from other countries, including the former republics of the Soviet Union. It's the place where we can work out and offer some advice, some recommendations. Uh, advice, good advice, which is not followed, is a waste of time. So that's why I wish the Baltic Forum not only to work out good recommendations, but also that these decisions are implemented. I would also like to thank my friend, uh, Yanis Rubanovich, who takes all the trouble to organize the Baltic Forum. I'd like to really thank him for this. I would like to wish you productive work and also to have a nice rest in Jurmala, Riga, Latvia. Thank you.